our next topic is cell theory so cell theory primitive cell theory is given by mathesis eskelden and theodor swan according to eskelden in 1838 Uh, all plants are composed of plant cell and its product and in 18, 1839 according to swan he also proposed that all animals are composed of animal cells and its product but he failed to explain that from where does new cells are arised so their drawback is from where does new cells are arised so in 1855 Rudolf Virchow modified primitive cell theory, which was given by Eskelden and Swan, and he said that omnicellular, acellular, which means uh, new cells are arise from pre-existing cell, and the uh, cell theory which was modified by Rudolf Virchow, it is known as uh, modern cell theory, and the three main points of modern cell theory is all the living organism is composed of cells. and second point is cell is the basic smallest unit and third one is new cells are arise from pre existing cell through cell division exception of this modern cell theory is virus because virus is the connecting link between living and non living when virus enters the living cell or the host cell they use the cell machinery of living cell and act as living but when it outside the host cell it act as non living today this much only thank you students have a nice day be safe at home